Frode. 
So she lit up the canal. What do I sit down and cut it off? For the hood trip to Welcome to the Hotel in California. Summer dance to remember. Summer dance to forget. Doggy's catch. Doggy's catch.
anarchist! You are the anarchist! You are the anarchist! This is the one! Have you thrown out of Kosovo? No music for ten years except for Serbian music. Serbian language music, Serbian propaganda, even the radio here was only allowed to play one tape in Albanian for the whole six years, they were for two hours a day. Everything else was Serb, Serb, Serb. The schools um, the schools were closed um, to Albanian language programs, university teachers sacked, so um, the whole everything had to be done underground in people's houses, teaching, schooling was all hidden. And the fact that now there is an opportunity for children to be creative, expressive, uh, to celebrate, we're here to encourage that. And they're fantastic kids, so they just love to joke, um, to play and to beat us up. <laughs> and, uh, um, and it's wicked. It is great it's fun. just a great place. Uh, new country. Yeah, and the first time I think that for at least ten years that anyone has had a sense of being able to do what they want to do. So and laugh without any fear of anyone coming in security forces or anything like that. Yeah, yeah. and there is some I don't know if you could say this, but there is a certain therapy to be had through music and through clouding, if you like, in that it allows a release of tension through some other means. So you have kids who, who knows, I mean, a lot of people have said that in a few years, they expect the signs to be more, to, to be more apparent of the trauma that has come over the last few months. I mean, these, these kids are fantastic. They don't, they don't seem to traumatize, they're full of life and love, but there will be some damage done probably, and, and music, art, drama, any kind of expressive art like that can help to 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 heal some wounds. We hope. How do you, you how can you see that their experience what they have experienced? Well, they're running around with guns. Every other little kid has got a little play gun and shooting each other. And every time we do these things, 
they we do all just <laughs> they all <laughs> jump in and start beating us up. <laughs> <laughs> well, that's like all kids. All kids. I don't think they don't. They don't seem traumatized yet. But like you say, in five, ten years, this is that's when when they will show that they have had a traumatic experience. What do you think you can do about it? What what, uh, what will will this help them? You think? I hope it doesn't hurt. Um. <laughs> No, it can teach him to play, to play fight, you know, to, to for, for it to be enjoyable to fight and play and to still be friends after we beat each other up, as opposed to this aggression which there is in the country. <coughs> People hate each other and that hate will stay. And fighting is is really a violent thing. And also, uh, a lot you see a lot of kids seem to respond to adults, especially strange adults they don't know, with either fear or aggression. And even to us, after after we've rolled around and played, we'll find people kicking you or whatever. And um, we found that just through smiling, talking, and saying no, this is bad, but we're still friends and not being um, uh, a typical grown-up. That we prove that perhaps they need not fear older people or other people. You, I, we hope to break some some kind of boundaries mm. because a lot of kids have it ingrained that they have to fight everything that's going to be a fight uh, and we turn that from a fight into just sort of something friendly and I don't know, I'd like to see that grow. Yeah. Also it's just a celebration and there's, there's not a lot of uh, attention a lot of groups and local people are starting to work with children, but but all their need, all their need for attention is not is not um, fully adequately. Um, oh, sorry. Uh, there's 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 not enough attention paid to to young children and community social work. Now we don't do a lot, but but there are different groups and there's a growing awareness that. That we have to pay attention to these to these kids and um, give them give them the attention that every child needs. And a lot of kids are just left here. To yeah, run most of them would have spent the last four or five months in refugee camps anyway, or up in Montenegro, and they've only just come back. So this could be a sense of of normality <coughs> that foreign white people or grown ups are coming here. That the war has actually finished, and they're not going to be chased away from their houses anymore. That this sort of thing is, is going on. It's that normal is, again. Yeah. And that it's okay to play and to be a child after perhaps witnessing things that are serious and so serious that they can age you and maybe make you miss a part of the, the real aspect of play, which is not aggressive or uh, confrontational. I don't know, these kids with the guns are scary, man. We sleep outside, outside our house, and every morning we get woken up by little bullets. And <laughs> plastic gun. Every other kid has got a plastic gun. But, but they're cool, man. They're, they're, they're basically uh, they're a great audience. They're a great audience. We, we would get this anywhere else. <laughs> they just love to play, and they get involved, and they actually work out all our tricks so that most of the surprises fall flat on their face because the kids have already got it. They're already thinking like that. Okay. Thank you. I have got a Thank you very much. Please.